Hey everyone, how you doing today? It's Super Bowl Sunday here in the Whiskey Den. And uh, you may not realize this by looking at me, but I'm not really into football. <laughs> but <laughs> I figure for Super Bowl Sunday, I would take another look at this Rick House Cask Strength um, bourbon out of the Gold Bar bo Gold Bar bottle company out of San Francisco. This is at 103 proof. It is straight bourbon whiskey cask finished with French oak staves. One of these days, I'm going to get around to reviewing this. I should have done it today, but I've done, you know, I've got a bunch of bourbon that's open. I don't want to open up more. This is the Gold Bar Reserve Collection which, if you can see the little swing tag, it's the official whiskey of the San Francisco 49ers. It's beautiful shelf dressing. So I'm just going to keep it over here. And since I have this one open, going to review it again. And, um, wait, St. Louis, Kansas City. Who's, okay, so it's the 49ers and the Kansas City Chiefs. Phew, I was going to say, say, okay, again, I'm not, <laughs> I'm not really the biggest football guy. I'll watch the Super Bowl and I know who's in the Super Bowl. So, uh, we're gonna, that's why we're going to do this. I did, um, <laughs> I did a rack of ribs out on the smoker and I'm like, well, they're Kansas, no, St. Louis. I don't know. They're they're ribs, all right. So it's either Kansas City style or St. Louis. I think they're Kansas City style. But I don't even know if the Chiefs are in Kansas City, Kansas, or Kansas City, Missouri. But it's a good excuse to drink some bourbon, right? So I did a review on this over a year ago as a first taste. As you can see, I still have half a a little less than half a bottle left. I have a bottle in reserve, which is nice because I got this at the BevMo in Chico, California about a little over a year and a half ago when we were there. It was a buy something at full price, get the second bottle for a nickel sale that they did. And I, you know, I, the bottle's cool. I, and I was like, I, and I looked up the, <laughs> I looked up online what the mash bill was. It says it on a bottle, 80% corn, 20% rye. No stinking malted barley to get in the way of the, of the full flavor. Uh, this one is finished with French oak staves. Again, it's 803 proof. It's weird. It says the collection number is 01 slash 08. So there we go. Uh, I really enjoy this. I, obviously, I've had a few pours of it. And I think this will be just the thing to go with my rib dinner for, for the evening. Probably before we watch the Super Bowl because I've slow roasted them all day out on the smoker. I think they're ready. So let's see what we think of this uh, Rick House by Gold Bar. I love the color. It's a deep, dark, like a red color. Uh, obviously brown, but it's it's like deep, dark red, reddish brown, like rusty water, which doesn't sound good if it's water. But when you come to when it comes to bourbon, a rusty brown color just sounds so rich and amazing. smooth nice so, I was doing a little search um, on Google to get the mash bill which is on the bottle but I want a little more information on it someone considered this one of the I think the worst whiskey that they had for 2023 on a YouTube video I didn't bother watching it because I really like it it's got a nice smooth um, profile on it the finishing with the French oak staves, just, just um, smooths all the 
what you know that high rye content corn and rye there's a reason why they put that malted barley in there to kind of meld things together and smooth it out but oh my goodness smooth rich it's pretty in a way it's more complex than you think it should be and um just a really nice elegant bourbon not to what do they say these days <laughs> throw shadow or not not to disparage the person who thought it was the worst bourbon on their channel but it's actually one of one of my um special special occasion bourbons it's made with hetch hetchy water which is out of san francisco just a really to me a really elegant nice special occasion bourbon i think it cost between 35 and 40 bucks when i was there got the second bottle for a nickel <laughs> so you know you equate that in there just the thing to go with those ribs. So, at the, um, obviously at this point, I don't know who's going to win the, the game. We'll watch it and figure it out. Not really my cup of tea. I'll say that, you know, I, I just, I'm not a football guy. Think Big Bang Theory, all right? <laughs> That's me. I'm into Star Trek. I'm in, into bourbon. I'm into the Beatles. I got my Beatles channel. Yeah, I'm into I'm into the geeky stuff, all right? Bourbon's probably the least geeky thing I'm into. So, if you're watching the game tonight and you have access to this Rick House, or if you got access to the Gold Bar and you're a 49ers fan, that's what I would crack open and enjoy while watching the game. If you don't, you know, hey, I should have done a matchup. I've got something from Kansas I think from Kansas City around here. The Ben Holiday. Is that from? No, that's Missouri. Forget it. All right. So until next time, it's me, David, coming to you from my whiskey den here in central Ohio. Hope your next pour is your best pour. We'll catch you soon. Root for the favorite team of your favorite team, and um, we'll see how it goes. Not that it's going to matter in a year who wins the Super Bowl tonight, but hey, if you're, if you're up for it, go ahead. All right. Well, I'm in it for the commercials. All right, so I'll see you soon. Thanks for watching. Hey everyone, if you like what you see, please like and subscribe so you can be notified of future videos as they drop. Thanks for watching.